Hello, Buzzer God, my name is Hotzer C and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, where last time we managed to get our way up here with our telescope. What we forgot last time. Um, we need oxygen in here, so let's try to lay a pipe. Let's go through here, um, maybe um, we can reuse the pipe that we have there. This one is empty, and we can take oxygen from here like this might work and then we should be able to operate this one however today's project is here on this side uh, let me remove that ladder because uh, let's stick in a bit below here and we are interested in this steel volcano because up here we want to have uh, a bit of uh, um, this equation, a rocket, I would call it, um, and for that, I think something like this. Helpful, and then we can go here. Alright, and then probably on this side, take this out, and as this is all very cold it will be tricky to get hot steam out of here up to the rocket without the steam not becoming water here uh, we have the slight issue uh, with the uh, turbine not cooling off enough uh, so we uh, see that we got a bit on the on the warm side let's, let's try to fix that So we do have two things that we need to care about this episode. One is the pipe up here so we can do research or not exactly research. Um, look at the stars to figure out where to launch our rocket to. And then second is beginning the set up for our rocket. I don't expect uh, we get to the point where we can finish the rocket today uh, or even uh, uh, launch it. At least then uh, up here uh, we want to have um, 
gas pump. Let's make this uh, this out of uh, of steel because the temperatures might be a bit too hot uh, in order for uh, just um, gold amalgam. And then we will have the pipe made out of uh, ceramic. Which is the best insulator that we have. Or basically the only insulator that we have. Um, we probably mm, need a gas filter somewhere here. That then the gas filter here was an output there. Um, there we go in, there we go up, and that's that. This way, mm, to begin with, we do not need that much power, so we can actually have. Let's have a, a large transformer anyway, um, because that one is made out of fine metal. Uh, we do have uh, sources for. base and I am pressing today all the wrong buttons all the wrong buttons but we will manage so they have quite a bit to do uh, until they get there at least pipe wise we are looking better Yes, they have everything almost up to here. That should be finished pretty soon. And then we can actually go this side. So I think I will make a cut here uh, and then be back once we have some actual problems. Up here in the telescope, we are making quite good progress. Uh, not only the first or the second asteroid, but we are on number six. And if we scroll out here, there is quite a way to go. However, in this episode, we are not focusing on, on reaching uh, all the way out. Um, we just have to get into outer space for a few additional materials. And then down here, um, you can see uh, we are pumping things out and uh, now we have a bit of uh, petroleum spilled over and that turned into sour gas which we are now pumping out and with less gas in here the, the copper uh, does not solidify anymore but I have set up uh, quite a loop here for cooling from the outside however if we look at this setup here where we have also cooling loop we can see uh, the, the liquid in here is not moving so 
That's why I also have a reservoir tank here um, to counteract that. And we will have um, a pipe going in here. We will do a quick click with the bridge beforehand so that we can basically just break that bridge. So here we are making some progress, um, set up the, the filter for steam, but there is still more to be done. And as you can see, we also uh, discovered a secret of yet another asteroid. So that's, that's quite, quite fast. So I think next priority probably be on finishing everything here so that we can get this set up we are making some progress I have emptied this pipe of petroleum because we want to uh, siphon off a bit of water from here so I can put it in here manually uh, or not manually uh, through the through the vent because while we have uh, liquid metal in here um, any water would instantly turn to steam and that would not work if we have this water here still. Um, we would also need a bit of uh, hydrogen in here again. Let's place it back there. We can disable this one so all the hydrogen goes that way. And I have led a second line, uh, which is not yet completed. Um, we can speed that up a bit here as well. And then up here, I led out a third lap that goes further up. However, not yet prioritized. In here, we almost have a vacuum, which means uh, we can start thinking about digging this one out. But actually, I want to first finish uh, this fix here on this side uh, before focusing on the next project. So uh, the duplicates are not uh, confused with where they should focus. All right, I managed to get this set up so far that it is or was working again, but because we uh, had the uh, liquid metal in here and just drop piecemeal of uh, water in there, the steam just got too hot and our uh, machinery here broke again so i think we will have to wait until this one becomes dormant make sure we do not have uh, liquid metal in here and then hopefully we can fix this once and for all but now let's actually focus here on this side um, and dig this one out and I also have planned this out and they are already making progress there and then of course we want to analyze this one It is 
is currently active. Steam comes out at 500 degrees. That should be hot enough um, once we have uh, uh, sufficient temperatures in here that we manage to uh, pump out the, 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 the steam and uh, get it all the way up and hopefully um, the pump will not break because it's made of steel which brings the, the temperature just up to 200 and 75 degrees. So we will see. Maybe we need for this one a similar setup like here. Just um, we probably do not want to cool it down too much. we actually want to have the steam. Okay, at least now we have piecemeal of, of water in here. It helps a bit, but we will have to wait for um, 35 cycles so not anytime soon uh, we can fix that one but we have certain tons of copper lying around we still have a bit of gold and now that we are at the surface uh, we also get access to gold and again copper ore and iron so that's probably where uh, we get um, uh, our future iron supply if we cannot find another iron volcano within this right. Yes, we get the steam out of here. that would also help. And then we probably just have to see how we can manage to fill our rocket with steam uh, while avoiding Yes. Well, it's already above 200. Okay, I think that was it with the with the, with the Brian in here. Analysis is complete. Um, this will get dormant in 30, 30 more cycles. So I think the next priority then is here on this side and I pro 
probably want to go over here, actually. Because I want the, the rocket silo all to the to the left or as, as left as uh, as possible. Okay, the missing piece of, uh, of wire here probably melted. think we made good progress not sure how stable this setup is but I dug out a, a piece of uh, a, a place here so that we can actually have our engine here and as a last act let's connect this pipe here and then we probably also want to have a bit more space here because eventually we will need a gantry uh, a gantry uh, that goes in this way so we would have the wall there if we have it one back and that's the closest we can get uh, but if we have three spaces in between i think that would be uh, uh, more helpful so we will have a wall here which means the floor goes out to there and then up here we will have just normal wall and then on the inside we will uh, build a ladder up and we will also have have a ladder here on this side so just to to clean out the, the space there but this will be a project for next time so don't forget to tune in when it's time for more oxygen not included until then goodbye